All right, we back. I'm about to talk to Kenny. Oh boy, this is about to be ridiculous. Let's get to it. I wanted to check on you. Make sure you're okay. She didn't want me to wait, but I had to. In case by some crazy chance, she didn't come back. That beautiful face. So I waited. I thought maybe she'd be different. You know what it feels like to get beaten almost to death. Peaceful. It feels peaceful. It was like I was floating away, watching the whole thing happen to me. And then I woke up again, and nothing's changed. I'm still taking a beating. Every day. Duck. Katja. Sarita. No peace. No rest. The punches just keep coming. Why the hell couldn't Carver have just finished me off? Obviously, I ain't helping anyone by being here. That baby's almost here, and Rebecca needs your help. Yeah, I guess she does. Now, don't worry yourself about this. It's nothing. Hadn't killed me yet, anyway. I should punch you in that mug. Talking crazy. It's all right, really. Oh shit! I don't Is know what to say. What are we supposed to do? We should see what's going on. Rest in peace, Sarita. She was fine. Are you okay? How does it feel? It feels wet. That's how it feels. Oh, What's here going she on? Go. Rebecca's water broke. Mm. Oh, Christ. We should... I don't know what we should do. Oh, fuck. Well, what do we do? Kenny, thank God. I think the baby's coming. What do we do? All right, all right. Give me a second. No way can Rebecca trap her like this. He's right. She's gonna make a lot of noise. They'll be able to smell her, too. Now you got no choice but to lock down and ride it out. What should we do first, Kenny? Kenny, come on, you gotta focus. Right, right, sorry. Clean water for one thing. And blankets. And we gotta get out of this damn cold, too. That map shows a couple of buildings nearby. Maybe one of them could do the trick. The museum seems like it could be a good start. I'll go. Good idea. Mike, think you could go with her? Sure thing. I'll check the building by the river. Okay, then. Kenny, you, uh, stick with Rebecca, and I will check the perimeter for walkers. Clem... I know it must have been hard, but thank you for talking to Kenny. I didn't say nothing. I'd love for you to give me and Mike a hand looking at the museum, but I was thinking... How do we know Jane ain't just gonna take off? Maybe you should go with her. Make sure she comes back. What do you mean by that? You know, she doesn't seem to like being around people much. And she volunteered to head off awful fast. I guess it could be nothing. She's helped us so far. Yeah, no, you're right. Maybe it's nothing. Just something to think about. Okay, we're looking for warm blankets, clean water, disinfectant. That all sound right? I'll go with Mike and Bonnie. All right, well, let's get going. All right, everyone, you know what to do. Let's be fast, and let's be careful. 
I should have just stayed, stayed there. I'm a kid. What am I going with y'all for? To do what? Y'all telling me go on missions and all types of foolishness. I guess that's the place there. Fuck. It's a wreck. You ain't even been inside yet. Just look at it. Glass all blown out, walkers hanging around. Well, no way to find out until we go and check it out for ourselves. Maybe we can still find something. Yeah, maybe. Sorry. I just really want sticking with y'all to work out. And it's been hard so far. How about you make it up to us by helping out with those walkers up there? Yeah, all right. Jane showed me a good way to attack them. If you take out a knee, they always fall. And then you can stab them in the back of the neck. Hmm. A good smack to the head's always that fine for me. So the knee is about halfway down the leg. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Let's do this before more of them show up. Watch out for the broken glass. It's all over. Okay. Somebody's already been through here. Guess that's not a surprise. Still, might be something worthwhile left. Let's check it out. We need to look fast, so we can get back to the others. Let's just make a sweep. I really don't want to go back empty-handed. Keep one eye on the woods while we're in here. I don't want nothing sneaking up on us. I watch this side, you watch the other. Deal. Cannon! 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 Nah, they're just for show. Be handy, though. Also really loud. Good point. What am I looking for? You think maybe they say that stuff about water and blankets just to get people out of the way? Oh, you don't know what the hell you're talking about. And you didn't have to come with me. Empty. No, I wanted to. Never mind. Sure, been some animals through here. Watch where you step. Hey, so any luck? No, not so much. Unless you want some broken glass. Lee would have loved this place. Oh yeah, Lee used to be a history teacher. I tell you, I sure don't like being near a graveyard with the world the way it is now. Where things are now. Do you see anything good? Not so far, but let's give the place a good going over. Ain't nothing else to look for. What's that? Mm. Hey, look at this. An old coat. Nice. Good find, Clem. You should hang on to that. It's gonna get a lot colder before it starts getting warmer. Maybe I could give it to Rebecca. That's a good idea. I'm sure she'll really appreciate it. I guess you've already got that old coat I gave you. I feel so bad about everything that happened. Hopefully you won't always think of me like that. Not that I blame you if you did. I haven't always used the best judgment. You finally opened your eyes about Carver and what a bad person he was. That's something. Yeah. All right. Clem found a jacket. That's great, but uh, isn't Gray the, you know, uh, the Confederate sir? We can't put Rebecca in a Confederate coat. Oh, I didn't even think about that. Guess it's better than nothing, though. Remember, they was uh, reenacting uh, the Civil War on South Park. The Confederacy. 
They took her dips. They took her dips. Mike looked like a uh, Denzel's son. What's his name? David Washington. The tenant. Who seen that movie? I ain't, I ain't been looking at no movies since this uh, pandemic been going on. I, I was going to watch uh, Wonder Woman, but I heard it was trash. Over here. Water. Bottled and clean. That's just what we need. It's locked. You want to kick it down? That'd make an awful lot of noise. Yeah, maybe. You know, if somebody was small enough, they could maybe squeeze through that gap there. I could try to pry it open some more, but I don't know if that'll help much. No, I mean, maybe... Are you sure you can't get it open? Okay, no, that's all right. Maybe I can just reach through to the right. lock. Happened. You okay, Bonnie? It's just a bump. I'm gonna be all right. Sorry you got banged up. Not sure my face was my best feature anyway. Come on, that's not true. Let me see your arm. No, I... I didn't get bit, just old scars. Mmm. At least now we got something to bring back. Oh baby, oh baby. I'll keep checking the other room. <laughs> Let's get this water. She Jones in. So it look, it seems like Bonnie was a, a heroin addict. Do not do drugs, kids. Please do not do drugs. It's not hey, a good look. I got this. Oh, Mike, you're useful now. That looks pretty heavy. Uh, that's all right. I know it looks like a lot, but we could all go through this pretty quick. Carver was crazy, but at least his shelves were always full. We're going to have to be conservative as hell. We'll make a plan. Everyone will have enough. I hope so. That baby's going to be hard on everyone, especially Rebecca. And between you and me, she's not looking too good. Hey, guys. Come on, stick close. You just walked on in like it owned the place. Figure it'd make a nice meal. We can eat raccoon? I'd eat the shit out of that raccoon. Not like, I mean, just, just that I'd be really happy to eat that raccoon. I'm yeah. starving. Fresh meat would go a long way with Rebecca. Yeah. Shoot! <laughs> Don't let it get away! Over here. Oh, oh, shit. Shoot. Dang it. Not with the walkers out there. Respect. Respect, Cole. Bigger than I was before. How did I get to a place where I'm sad I'm not eating raccoon? Well, I'm sort of glad it got away. It had a family. Yeah, me too. Come on, let's just get this back to Rebecca and the others. Unless he jumped on you and bit your face. Much time to waste. He bit your face. I'm not supposed to be in labor yet, Kenny. What if something's wrong? 
Nothing's wrong. Babies know how to be born. How long did your son take? How you doing, Beck? Okay. I'm okay. How did you guys make Museum's out? Museum's a bust. All glass walls shattered. It'd be impossible. And it was picked over pretty good. Lots of folks probably been there before us. The walker in there almost got us. Lucky Mike was there. Clem's the one who finished it off. Looks like you also found some water. We sure did. Good, good. We save all of that for Rebecca. Anybody else gets a thirst, you can go to the river. you made it back safe. How are you feeling? Scared. And it hurts. <laughs> I wish Alvin was here. Alvin was a good man. He was nice to me, and always looked out for everyone. That man had one of the biggest hearts of anybody I've ever met. I should have told him that more often. I know it's a waste of time, but I can't stop thinking about things Message. I should have said to him. Things I should have talked to him about. Alvin told me that he thinks the baby's gonna be a girl. Oh yeah? That big dummy never did have a sense for these things. I've got a feeling this one's a boy. You're a good kid, Clementine. I'm glad you'll be there to watch out for this baby. Ah, oh shit. I got this. I'm worried that we ain't seen Jane in a while. Go check on her, would you? Yeah, go on ahead. I'll be fine. Okay, so let's go look for the... Where Luke at? There's a lot of people to talk to. Let's go find Jane. Oh, I did see Luke. He said if we want water, we'd be at the river. Tripping. I'm trying to stay in a child's place. Jane? Man, this game is beautiful, man. The art style, man, it's just like straight out of the comments. Clementine, up here. Damn, Jane. All you had to say is, Psst, up here. You yelling out my name. Stop yelling out my government. Oh, hey. Museum was a bust, huh? Yeah, it's all broken and smashed up. It would never be a safe place for Rebecca to have the baby. I was afraid of that. Check this out. This gate's still locked, which means that hopefully no one's gotten to whatever was locked in there in the first place. I've been trying to get it open, but it's locked pretty tight. Can't see what's inside. That could be a place for Rebecca to have the baby. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Look at you, Jane. Hmm, maybe I can pick the lock. The nail file? Versatility is not overrated. You know, uh, it wouldn't hurt to try a heavier hand with this thing. See if you can find something bigger. We might need to bust the mechanism. Uh -oh. Make an observation. There were more cannons in the museum. Mike said they're just for show. They fill them with cement so they're safe. Oh. <laughs> Yeah, and like I was saying, man, 
all this stuff is shut down and stuff and not going to the movies man so what what has been occupying your time uh during this uh this whole little pandemic situation this honestly because of this pandemic um and, and, and influences by uh, many of people. I started this YouTube channel. I was like, I'm not about to just sit in the crib and not do nothing. Might as well uh, create something for for the peoples, for the childrens. <laughs> Find anything? No, not even trash. Is there any? Can I, can I go to the back? Invisible wall. Mm. There's some buildings across the river. I think I can see a church. The nearest river crossing is miles up. Rebecca wouldn't make it in her condition. Keep it in mind. Though. Jane, there's someone coming toward us. Shit, shit, shit. He's coming this way. And who knows if he has friends nearby. I don't like having some stranger sneaking around. Should we run for it? Normally I would, but it's too much of a risk. We can't lead him to the others. But we should scope him out and see what he's up to. I don't like having some stranger sneaking around so close to the others. We've got enough on our plates with a baby coming. Last thing we need is someone telling their friends about the new easy targets in the neighborhood. Maybe I can try talking to him. Good call. Shit. Hide now. He got the Forrest Gump joint. My mama always said life was like a box of chocolates. Hey. I just want to talk to you. Who are you? I'm Arvo. I'm okay. going to go. I don't want to shoot. I don't want to shoot anyone. Especially Malinka Devochka. Little girl. You don't have to shoot anyone. Just put the gun down. <gasps> Back up. Put the bag down. Clem. Make sure he doesn't have any other weapons in there. No, I have no more guns. I swear to... Anything? Whoa. That's a serious stash of meds. No, 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 no. Take whatever you want, but don't take the medicine. It's for my sister. What do you mean, take? You ain't got nothing else. Sick. The pain makes her cry, and that makes those things come. Please. Is it just you and your sister? No. I have many friends in the woods. Sister or not, we could really use that stuff. No, you are not nice people. You have already left me defenseless, and now you... You take my sister's medicine? You are worried. Hey, deep deep. we've got people who are suffering. Who need this medicine? Mm. Luke's still a wreck after Carver's. Kenny's a mess. Rebecca's in pain. Look at all of it. Clementine, we need people that stuff. People are suffering just as much as yours. You are not special. Clementine, yes, you must believe We don't believe, believe a fucking word about your sick... You're not taking them. I'm not robbing anybody. Just let him go. Oh, Bursche. Thank you, Clementine. Thank you.
No, what are you doing? You don't have to do this. Just let me go. Don't uh, you ever come around here again. I don't care if you do have some sick sister. The next time I see you, you won't just be walking away. Ooh, go. you'll be walking dead. Hmm. Shit like that, shit like that. Don DeMarco, Don DeMarco. Can't believe I've gotten into this mess. Threatening some stupid kid? We should go get everyone else. Yeah. Go get the others. I'm gonna get this place opened. Then we need to get moved in ASAP. I ain't about to rob that dude. He said he got people. He can go back and be like, Hey, yo, that took my stuff. Nico Belly. <laughs> Clem, Clem, hey. Any luck with that observation, Dick? I was just checking on Rebecca and Kenny. They said they hadn't heard from me in a while. I don't guess there'd be much, but Jane seems pretty resourceful. Jane and I were trying to open the gift shop and a stranger showed up. What? Shit. This is the last thing we need right now. Jane took his gun and scared him off. Well, I, uh, I'm glad you're okay. Is Jane still up there now? Yeah. She's trying to get the gift shop opened. You know, I can't figure her out. I mean, she really lays it on the line, but at the same time, she doesn't show you anything that counts. I'm never quite sure if she just done like people just plain out done like me. I don't know. Yeah, she's kind of an odd duck, but she got her shit together more or less. A lot more than some. Jane seems like the kind of person who gets tempered by hardship, you know? But when I look at Kenny now, he just, he seems broken. And broken people get reckless. I know you got a history with him. Look, I think he's a good guy. At least started as a good guy. But I just think he's had to take more than he can handle. Now, I ain't got nothing to say. I need to tell the others about the deck. Yeah, good. I will, uh, I'll see you back there. You're not gonna do that to me. I, I'm on the fence about everybody. I'm a little girl. <laughs> I'm Clementine. I, I I'm trying to figure I'm trying to figure out all this. <gasps> shit, shit. Oh god. Breathe like I told you. Okay. 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 Oh god. Oh god. Rebecca. <sighs> shit. Walkers. How they get that close without anyone seeing them? That was Luke. Kenny, we've got to do something. Uh oh. Kenny, we can't stay here. The museum. It's our only choice. No, Jane and I found a place. I'll show you. Good. Someone help me up. Oh God, there's so many. Mike, help Kenny. On it. <laughs> Listen to me, Mike. Please. Are we having this discussion? All right, let him rock. Kenny, beating on the oh, same man. walker. Let's go. They just want dialogue. Like, I'm. It's not even a time to even be having that discussion about him. Who cares?
about as human as I've felt in a long time. I Man, they up here. Clementine. G Jesus, Clem, it's just not. Um, Jane? What? Clem, listen. Uh, Wait, what's going on? In here. Let's get you comfortable. What the fuck are you two doing up here? Kenny, what's going on? We got God knows how many walkers out there, which you were supposed to be keeping an eye out for. Hey, hold on a second. Just tell me what's going on. What's going on is you're a reckless fucking moron. I'm reckless. You know, you got a lot of nerve, Kenny. Rebecca's having the baby. Now? No! Fuck. I'm sorry. Shit. Right Shit. over here. Uh. They're coming up the stairs. Here. Well, we should. You want to help? Get out there and keep the walkers off us. I'll do this. I've been here before. They can't rush us on the stairs. Shoot them before they get to us. I'm going outside. I'll help hold them back. Go. I've got Rebecca. Here they come. Here. We can't let them up here. What y'all gonna do? They down there looking <gasps> dumb. Oh no. We got a head full of hair. Hey, Clementine. Hey. How's he doing? He's perfect. Who's a perfect little man? Who's the most perfect little man in the whole world? He looks like Alvin. You think so? Definitely. Thank you. <coughs> I'm fine, I'm fine. I just wish I could get warm. Clem, 
Why don't you give her that coat we found? We found. Sorry, you know, about the color. You really think I care about that? <laughs> Do you want to hold them? Could I? Of course. Your family. Here. Mm. sister <laughs> here let me take him you both should rest especially you when's the last time you slept Kenny oh, about two years ago I'm fine plus somebody's got to watch you while mama gets your beauty sleep you never forget that smell that baby smell man ain't nothing like it <sighs> Now my daughter, you smell them pits now. I'll be like, girl, you ripe. <laughs> Put some deodorant on. <laughs> oh, shit. What are you doing? Listen, I'm sorry. I've got to go. Come on. The longer I stay, the harder it'll be. I understand. Good. Peace out. I was worried this was going to turn into a thing. Yeah. You know, I get Jamie, it. Sarah, I'm not going to stick around and watch it happen to you too. You know the score. You're a smart kid. But I thought you believed in me. <laughs> I do. But give it enough time. And everyone's luck runs out. Listen, when the shit hits the fan, because it always does, mm -hmm. remember that you can make it on your own. It's not an option for everyone. If things start heading south, don't let them drag you down with them. You don't owe them anything. They'll make you feel like you do, like it's all one happy family. Oh, when push comes to shove. Yeah, I know. Good. Okay. I'm just having a conversation with you, Jane. You got the D and you dipped off. You, uh... You take care of yourself. You're different. I mean that. Here. Versatility is not overrated. Hey, right, give me a weapon. Thank you. I'll take it. Thanks. Yeah. I, uh... I gotta go. Peace. Don't worry, you'll be back. I guarantee it, I stand by it, eh? <laughs> you'll be missing me. Hey, yo, Jake! Oh, Luke. Hey, thought you'd be asleep by now. You okay? I'm fine. Okay. Good. <laughs> Hell of a night, though. The temperature's dropping. We're low on food. I think we gotta stay put for a while. You know, for Rebecca and the baby. So I'm thinking as soon as it gets light, Jane and I should go explore. See if we can find some place to scavenge. Jane did, bruh. What? Jane left. For good. What? When? Just now. Are you serious? She didn't say anything about leaving to me? <laughs> what the fuck? Aww. Damn it! Hey, keep it down. Sorry. I... Sorry. Just... Jane's gone. Really? Luke? Of all the childish bullshit. Childish? God damn it, Kenny. You know what? Just... Lay off. No, you put our lives, this baby's life at risk, so you two could roll around like fucking teenagers. Right. Look, I made a mistake, all right? No, it's not all right. What do you want from me? I'm gonna let y'all hash it out. I'm sorry, okay? I fucked up. But you know what, Jane? She made an offer, and 
Jesus Christ, I needed it, okay? I mean, look around you, okay? Everything is shit. So forgive me for one day enjoy one moment of something else. Whoa, buddy. But this baby, he's what matters now. Got it? So get your shit Honey, together. Where's my baby? Is everything all right? Everything is fine. <laughs> We're gonna need a good place to raise him, which ain't here. We gotta push on. We head north, get to Wellington. That's our best shot. There's a town across the river. It might be safe there. Or at least it might be a good stop on the way. Kenny! I'm sorry. I thought she was gonna get some rest for Rebecca. Clem's got a point. That could be a whole town full of supplies, and not that far from here. A whole lot better than here, anyway. Looks like that's our best bet. We need to get on the road as soon as possible. We leave at first light. Whoa, whoa! What are you talking about? <laughs> Rebecca needs rest. A few days at, at the least. We've got that baby formula. And it won't help the rest of us. Now what about shelter? We'll freeze out here. Kenny's right. We should leave in the morning. Rebecca is not in any condition to travel. I'll be fine. If there's a chance there's food, we have to risk it. <sighs> okay, fine. If that's what you want. That's the problem Look, with having I'll try to get some sleep. babies in the apocalypse, it's been a bro. Long day. We got to keep moving. We got to get food. You got to figure something out. Just sitting here. <laughs> they didn't give me the option to say Rebecca could rest here while we go into town and get the supplies. Because I would have said that. Sorry. But she got to come with us. Okay, Bex. I'm sorry. It's going to be all right. <laughs> and she's not doing too good either. Where do we go from here? On foot. We're going all the way. <laughs> if two of us don't want it, I'll lay my money on it. Starting today, and we're going all the way. <laughs> you all right? She's exhausted. We all are. I can keep going. We didn't get in the town. We should have stayed put. We should have stayed put until she was in better shape. She wasn't gonna get no better back there. We gotta find food. Get her someplace warm. This look like someplace warm to you? We could still turn back. That's not an option. Everybody hang in there. We gotta keep moving if we're gonna make it to that town before nightfall. You don't even listen to anyone else. You just go on barking orders. You gotta lighten up, okay? You're pushing them too hard. You're not helping anything by arguing. Don't forget, you agreed with me last night that we should get moving as quick as possible. I said about arguing, Kenny. I didn't say nothing about agreeing with you. Or disagreeing. Asshole. Rebecca, let me take the baby. <sighs> He's okay. I've got him. No, you rest for a minute. I'll wash him. Back off, Kenny. She said she doesn't want you to take the baby. Don't be weird about it, okay? I ain't being weird about it. Yeah, you kind of have been. And not just right now. Don't get all bent into a pretzel. I was just trying to help. People are too damn sensitive sometimes. Hello? What is this? Minas Lishna! Arvo? Arvo? Jane and I met him on the observation deck. Before everyone else came. That's the guy? You know this son of a bitch? Well, what's he want? <laughs> he doesn't look like much. That ain't the point. Hello? Please? He has a sick sister. They might be in trouble. <sighs> All right. Hello, your name is Clementine, yes? 
Hi, Arvo. These are your friends? I'm hoping you can help me now, not like before. All of you can help. What do you need? How can we help? I need, uh, uh, things for... bandages. I need bandages. Are you... hurt? No. Nikaki Arushi! Nikaki Arushi! Nikaki Arushi! Fuck! Это они? Да. Это они. Скажи им, чтобы они поставили их оружие на пол, и что мы забираем все, что они имеют. Что ты хочешь? English! English, do you speak it? Может. What did your friend say? I told them you are the ones who robbed me. What? It's funny that you're just a little girl. Robbed? And they want you and your friends to put down the guns, so we can take your things. Whoa, whoa, hang on. What the hell? Why get excited? Clementine, you robbed this guy? It wasn't me who took your stuff. It was Jane. It, it wasn't any of us. Jane, where's the other woman? Что происходит? Их было двое раньше. I do not see a woman who was with you. She's gone. She left the group. It's a trap. I know it. Они прячутся. Я знаю, что они прячутся. This can be easy for you. Arvo, скажи, чтобы они опустили оружие. All of you, just put your guns down. This will be fine. We have a baby. You have a baby with you? У них грудничковый ребенок. Знаю, что хорошо до тебя. Опусти оружие кажется, сейчас. И слишком много. Бурику отойди. Drop that now or I'm gonna fucking shoot it. I'll do it. Drop it. Drop it. Don't fucking don't move. I said don't move. Ты хочешь умереть? Не зли меня. Ты думай, что я хороший мужчина. Бурику, Бурику, остановись. Опусти оружие. I wasn't going to shoot. I'm so I should have just took the medicine Arvo you so you see that right you and 51% of players refuse to steal from Arvo left Sarah at the park 58% crawled through ticket booth I want about to do that. Bonnie, please. Y'all need to start doing something and stop putting me in little tight holes. Whoa. Pause. <laughs> Held the baby. Shot Rebecca. Y'all can read that. <laughs> I didn't want to shoot Rebecca. But are you serious, Arvo? They only took, we didn't take your supplies, brother. We just took, she just took the gun. You're a scrub. And you set us up? <sighs> That's the end of episode four. My thoughts? Everybody I come in contact with are some fools. I'm a 11 year old leader. I'm the leader of this. I told Mike, go help Kenny. He was like, I'm on it. I said, Bonnie, I ain't going through no crate. I ain't going through no gate. She goes, stick her hand in there. Welcome to the jungle. I'm the leader of this. I told I told Jane, don't steal this stuff. We're going to give it back to him. I'm the 11-year-old leader. This is the problem. Why are y'all letting me make the decisions? Y'all grown as hell. <sighs> I digress. Hey, shout out to everybody that's watching the channel. Salute to everybody. I love y'all. 
Um, be positive. Be safe in this world. Uh, we're going to get on to episode five. And uh, much love. Peace.